Hello! <laughs> Monday the 6th of January 2014 and I have discovered something on the way back home from the swimming pool. House stones really sting people with bald heads or at least bald patches. It hurts! Well, thank God I'm back in the dryer. Look, this black thing, black hooded top, soaked here. Am I boring? Oh, you think that's very funny, don't you? Eh? House stones on people with bald head. It hurts. It really hurts. Oh, by the way, uh, thank you to Wendy last week, who kindly pointed out in one of my previous short videos that she could see washing hanging out on my banister. Correct, Wendy. You did see the stuff hanging out on the banister. You know, you probably saw the uh, 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 cushion, the um, pillowcase. You saw the um, duvet cover. And, of course, my socks and there. Almost dry now. Thank you for pointing it out to me, Wendy. We can't, we're not all rich, dear. We can't afford to turn on the tumble dryer, dear. I'm not turning on the dryer. Now, do you remember that miserable old cow in the swimming pool last week? Oh, come back in the office, dear. Come back in the office. Ah, back in the little studio again. Oh, look, Wendy. Look, another sheet hanging up in here, dear. Yes, clothes dotted all around the house so that we don't have to turn on the tumble dryer. We're not all rich like Wendy. Oh, she's got a massive, massive ass in the cup. Rolling in money, Wendy. Rolling in money, dear. Massive ass. She has the tumbler on constantly. The tumble dryer is on permanently. Anyway, do you remember that miserable woman in the swimming pool? On New Year's Day. Do you remember her? Well, I haven't seen her again. I'm so pleased about that. I hope she hasn't drowned. I really do. You mustn't wish bad things on other people. I've been told that before. You mustn't. Now, stop it. You, you're wishing. But I wouldn't do such a thing. I promise I wouldn't. Anyway, uh, stupid woman number two now, boys and girls. So, uh, I was DJing on Saturday night somewhere, okay? And this woman come up to me. Have you got the Christina Aguilera song that I've been dancing to all throughout September while I was on holiday? This woman is about a little bit younger than me, probably about 46, 47, OK? Which one do you want, madam? Oh, I don't know. Uh, you must know the one. We were all dancing to it while I was on holiday in wherever it was in uh, September. And I thought, she looks a little bit old to be dancing at a discotheque on holiday. You know, look, so can I use the term mutton dressed as lamb? Can I use that? To, uh, what do you mean me? Do I look like mutton dressed like lamb? Anyway, back to the story. Stop pointing out my faults. I would never point out faults of anyone. You know that. So she carries on. Well, you must know it. You're the DJ. I said, well, she's had about 15 tracks out, Christina Aguilera. Which one is it? Because I don't know which one you want. Well, you must know it. Well, I don't. Well, can you name them all? I said, well, all of them? She said, yes, probably not. Well, why not? I said, because I can't remember them all. I've got 5,000 tracks in that computer. Oh, she said, well, surely you know them. She said, we must know it. We were dancing to it in September while I was on holiday. I'm sorry, I don't know it. The idea is you ask for a record, I play it. You need the title and the artist. Sometimes I can work out one from the other. Today, I'm afraid I can't. She said, well, name all the 15 ones that you mentioned. I said, well, I can't. Oh, well, you're not a very good DJ then. And walked off. Oh, you want to hear some of the things they say to us, dears. Anyway, it's all too much. I'm going to have to have a lie down. Thank you. See you tomorrow.